Welcome to Creative Art. I am Nalima bringing you the best art tutorials on YouTube. So if you're an art lover, do consider subscribing this channel so you don't miss any updates on the recent art forms. In today's tutorial, I will be showing you how to use deco transfer sheets. These are all different beautiful deco transfer sheets I have starting from rupees 69 to 99. Most of the times you can get them on discount and now you can avail additional 5% off on all of your online purchases from Itsy Bitsy website just by using my code which is NILIMA5. N I L I M A 5. These deco transfer sheets are really easy to use and can be transferred on different surfaces like wood, plastic, glass, leather, metal, painted surface, MDF, paper, etc. In today's tutorial, we will use blossom and bike sheet and transfer this beautiful image on a leather pouch. Other than that, we will need white matte chalk acrylic paint from little birdie and for varnish we will use decor varnish gloss from little birdie a flat hair brush number six and a sponge all these materials will be listed and linked in the description box below from where you can buy them online now let's start the tutorial friends First of all, using a scissor, start cutting the required design you need. For this leather pouch, this time I have decided to cut this beautiful rose printed design. And using scissor, I have already pre-cut the design accurately just according to the size of this pouch. After cutting the design accurately, place it on the base and take a rough measurement whether it fits your base or not so this design perfectly fits the base so now let's keep it aside and start preparing our base which is a leather pouch and for that i'm going to use the home decor collection matte chalk acrylic paint from little birdie pour it in your palette now using a sponge tap 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 on the white acrylic paint and then just according to the shape of design I'll start placing white acrylic color on our base. And now let the coloring part get dry completely for one to two hours. After two hours, the base has got dried up completely and now it is ready for our next step to place the transfer sheet. For that, gently remove the clear transparent sheet in this way. Place the design upside down on the surface where you intend to transfer the design. So this is an important part and then just from the center to outwards start pressing the design in this way. Center to out, center to out. Now in this cup I have water and I have dipped my sponge in water. I'm going to gently tap, tap, tap the wet sponge on the design. Now wet a sponge and dab the wet sponge on the transfer paper in this way. You can clearly see that the transfer paper has changed its color. It's completely wet. So now I will gently remove the transfer image and finally this is how beautiful it looks. You can see so beautiful bright and clear. Now just after a few seconds I'm going to use decor varnish the gloss version directly on the transfer me sheet. And then using a flat hair brush, gently spread the varnish 
all over the transfer machine. And now finally, just let it get dry for at least 24 hours, you start using this leather pouch. Now after 24 hours, our varnish has got dried up completely and this leather pouch is absolutely ready for use. And now when I turn my camera, here we have, and here we have the most faithful cat in the world, Mickey. Right? Yeah. And now friends, in the same way, you can decorate any item you want using this beautiful deco transfer sheets. As you have seen in this tutorial, they are really, really very easy to use and you can transfer them on almost any surface you want. Just cover it up with some decor varnish and after 24 hours, it is absolutely ready to use. I hope friends, this tutorial was helpful for you. So please do subscribe this channel and share this tutorial so that more and more people People can get creative watching creative art tutorials thank you for watching and have a nice day